Hey guys, this is Maya Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Yellow. In the last episode, we defeated some trainers on Route 25, even though they're not part of a Nugget Bridge. In this generation. So yeah, now we're gonna confront this guy with the tie. A cool guy with a girlfriend. PDA! I mean, I'm fine with just PDA in general. I mean, I mean that'd be cute, you know? Tell us if this person doesn't you know, love each other or not, but when it gets extreme, like scarily extreme, like in your face extreme, that's when I can get pissed off sometimes. I mean, it's not out of jealousy, but out of like. I just find it inconsiderate. Whoa, 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 and it's actually pretty powerful. Very powerful. Like, pretty powerful. Whatever. It doesn't help that, you know, Radata also has a good attack. It's that. Oh, darn! You just f messed up in front of your girlfriend. No, she won't. No. <laughs> wait, wait. Yeah. That's right. I'm the man. I'm the dude. Nobody messes with me. And that TM19 was seism seismic toss. Which is pretty useful. It does. If. I'm gonna stop these guys if we have been talking to them. Um, so, what does Seismic Toss do? What? What did you get ass? So, Seismic Toss. The, the amount of damage Seismic Toss deals is equal to your level. That may, that may think that, you know, that kind of sucks a little bit. You know, like, everything. I mean, it's a fixed amount of damage, but. It can actually be pretty useful against, you know. I knew how to fight you accordingly. I mean, there's some Pokemon that benefit from using Psychic. I mean, Seismic Toss. What am I saying? For example, like those that are not strong off offensively, well, it doesn't matter. As long as they're at a high level, Psychic Toss will do, you know, a good amount of damage. It's used a lot in, you know, strategic and competitive settings, I guess. But, yeah. And, no. Seismic Toss does not. Uh, you tried to wrap me and you failed, so now I'm gonna slam you for that. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, so, unfortunately, Seismic Toss is not as epic as, you know, it is played out to be in the anime. No, it does not necessarily mean Charizard grabs you and, you know, spins you around in a huge circle and crashes you down in a surefire, you know, finishing move. Not as epic as, you know, that. Oh, come on, no. Okay, good. Good, yes. That's good. Alright, that's good. Good job, Ricky. So, we defeated the youngster. <laughs> You're a born loser. Um. I don't. Yeah, I think I would know why I wanted to do that. So, here we have our last trainer on Route 25. At last. And I want everything. Okay, I don't know what that was, but yeah. This last has some grass Pokemon. Grass and poison types. Which is why I said really up front. So yeah, let's burn this Oddish. Um I guess one disadvantage in not evolving really is well, you know. If it evolved, it probably would have when it KO'd that Oddish, I guess, maybe. But, you know what, it's all good, it's all good. Yeah, it's all good. Pidgey. Um, let's use Pikachu. Well, I'm using Pikachu and Ruby. I'm not, well, whatever. I'm just going for whatever. There we go. So that's two Pokemon down, one to go. And it's another Oddish. So guess what, Ridley, you're up. Yeah, not much going on here. Oh, critical hit, nice. So yeah, that, that, my friends, is that. I'm not so jealous. Wait, what? I'm not so jealous. 
No, you may not have a Clefairy, because I never caught a Clefairy. Just, you know why I never caught a Clefairy? Because my bitch messed it all up. Anyway, so, oh, what is this place? Sea Cottage. Who lives here? Where's the sea? Are you telling me that this is the sea? This is not the sea. It's like two freaking ponds. Well, I guess, oh, I guess it's not gonna... Oh, here's the sea. Oh my god. Oh, that makes much more sense now. <laughs> Silly me. Oh my god, so it's a film. Uh, yeah. Is there any anime distance to the back? Oh, he's just confused. Huh? He got confused. He got, he got confused. Let's look at the computer. Teleporter is displayed on a PC monitor. Huh, you mean this? What the hell is this? Yeah. <laughs> he just like so freaking confused and uh? Wait. Look at his eyes. <laughs> uh, up and down, up and down. So is this a Pokemon? A rare Pokemon? Let's catch it! I am a Pokemon. No, I'm not. Call me Bill. Bill, not a Pokemon. <laughs> Pokemon rule. Bill, 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 not a science nerd. I'm Poke Nerd. Why does this ruin everything? I'm a true blue Pokemon nerd. Poke Nerd. What's it have stuff on book? Well, the like Pikachu's book is better. I'm not joshing you. I screwed up an experiment and got to combine with a good Pokemon. And the anime was a Kabutops. I say no. Come on, you gotta. But thou must! What do you say, Chief? He's okay, alright. Wait. I never got to say yes, and. I never. He never gave me the chance to say yes, and you just. Wow, you're really commanding, dude. You know what? <laughs> Confused Pikachu, yay. Anyway, so yeah, you pissed me off. <laughs> so. Oh my god, we have to go through this again? Okay, so I'm back to where I... Okay, so I'm back to where I, you know, messed up a little and, you know... So, whatever. Let's just type in a computer and do some programming that I guess I assume I know how to do, I guess. Even if I'm like a kid. Hey, it worked. So, oh, what the... <laughs> oh my god! Jesus' <laughs> face is... Now that was a Pikachu face I was expecting. Yeah! Thanks, bud. I owe you one. Stop, did you come to see my Pokemon collection? You didn't? That's a bummer. Yeah, because I don't like you. I don't like you! What are you thinking? Oh, yeah, maybe this will do. Ooh, an SS ticket. What is it for? That cruise ship. SSN is in Vermilion City. Oh, Vermilion City. Its passengers are all trainers. That's exciting. Free experience! You invited me to my party, but I can stand fancy dudes. Cause you're a Poké Nerd! Poké Nerds are... Whatever. Why don't you go instead of me? Okay. Oh, saying the same thing. Pikachu? <laughs> Pikachu's confused again. And he's following me now. And he's normal. Okay. So, while we're here, let's look at this computer and... Wait. Um, wait. Wasn't I supposed to get some... Uh... Oh, okay. Rare Pokemon on this PC. Sure thing, Bill. Favorite Pokemon list. In here, well, we've already seen Eevee. You know, since Gary the bitch has it. But here's, you know, one of his evolution forms. Flareon. It's a fire type. And here's Jolteon. A thunder type. Electric type! Electric type! And for Vaporeon, a water type. And here's a cool thing about Eevee. In this generation, you can Eevee can evolve into three different kinds of Pokemon. If you give E like there are three different ways for Eevee to evolve. Flareon, Jolteon, and Vaporeon. Later on, Eevee gets more, you know, choices for evolutions, but yeah. This is the first instance of, you know, branched evolution. Yeah, there we go. So yeah, this is the sea. <laughs> Which I didn't see at all. Yeah, ha ha ha, very funny. Anyway, so, um, yeah, so, interestingly, Gary will evolve his Eevee into one of the, 
three EV evolutions. But which one will we evolve EV into in this game? We'll find out. We'll find out. And okay, so there's nothing to do, so we just came back to Cerulean and City because wait, Officer Jenny's out of the way. Oh, she's out of the way. What's going on? I can enter the building now. And she's we're positive that being came up is been just pop wait. Oh, she's doing the same thing, but you're out of the way. Why? Well, visiting Bill triggers this event, so you can go inside. Damn, he went in. He was trying to dig the way into no good. Wait, so... Oh, so you just dig to make us break in. Did this inspire what happened in the anime when Team Rocket stole that one... Well, no, it wasn't a drill. It was a vacuum thing. Those miserable rockets, look what they did here. They stole TM for teaching Pokemon how to... Oh, wait, so they stole dig from here. And I guess he made manufactured like his own TM. Here's some books on the ground. And some stools out of place. Oh, and then... Tipped plant, no. Uh, you must pay for the tipped plant. Yeah, you'll pay for the plant. You, you bitch. Hey, stay up. It's not your yard. Huh? Me? I'm in. I'm an incident. I'm an innocent bystander. Don't you believe me? No. Let's bring it on, bitch. <laughs> so here we have another rocket with a whip. He wants to whip us, but I'm gonna whip his ass first. He's inside a mud shop. I sent him to sand troop. Let's bring it on. Slash. I was going to send out a Drowsy. Drowsy is a psychic type. This is the first psychic type. No, sorry, is the first second type we see. But yeah. Drowsy knows hypnosis, which can put you to sleep. But its accuracy is as bad as Sing. So yeah, Drowsy is pretty defensive. Like, that's his game. And Sandra could do level 21. Oh, wait, so... Oh, this is it. Um, you'll see. So we just defeated that rocket. He just kicked this guy's ass. Stop! I'll give up! I'll leave quietly! And we get money! Oh, that's... Oh, never mind then. Okay, I returned to TMS store. And we recovered TM28. I figured it moving. Bye! Last off. Now, this team is actually useful for once. I actually plan to use water gun for an attempt only. It will bubble beam. Actually bubble beam. Um, but yeah, this... Oh, well, this is thunder wave. Yeah. Anyway, TM28. Is dig. And I'll actually teach it to Sandshrew. Yes. Because naturally, Sandshrew cannot learn any ground moves. Just because of its moveset, I guess. But yeah. What does dig do? Okay, well. Outside of battle, it lets you escape from. get out of dungeons, like, you know. Like that. Like quickly. And what? It, it'll transport you. and it'll teleport you out of a dungeon, like Mount Moon. Back to the Pokemon Center. It's like an escape rope, pretty much. Except it's on your Pokemon, it's free. So, in battle, what does it do? Well, your Pokemon will dig into the ground for one turn, where it's pretty, you know, invulnerable. Except for to, to some attacks, like, you know, you'll swift, I guess. So, yeah, um, for one turn, it'll be underground, out of sight, out of range, and the next turn, it'll pop up an attack. Now, in this game, Dig is freaking overpowered. It's as, its base power is 100, as strong as Earthquake. So, it's pretty much... So, Dig is essentially a delayed Earthquake, with some function outside of battle. So, I'm actually interested in having Sanshu and its evolution keep Dig for the duration of the game. So, I mean, there's no difference... I mean, yeah, I mean, I'll be fine with, like, waiting the extra turn, but, yeah. Dig is freaking good in this game. I mean, it gets heavily toned down in the future generations, like, the next generation is base power, base power 60. I think that in the fourth generation is base power lifted back up to 80. So yeah, Sancho has learned a very new move. Very nice, very nice. Hey, I don't want to Oh, we can't go east, cause... There's a freaking bush in the way! We can't go to route 9. However, I think we can... Go south and go around! Yes, let's do that in the next episode of Let's Play Pokemon Yellow! Bill Nye the Pokenerd! Bill Nye the Pokenerd! Bill Nye the Pokenerd!
Bill, 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 Bill,